Hello and welcome to this week's Spiritual Spiral Messages. I am Anuradha and I will share general guidance for this week starting 5th of April. So subscribe to this channel if you have not subscribed, like and comment. Comment as what you would like to hear more and also you can share feedbacks to the previous videos. So let's begin with this week's messages. This week we are guided by the Easter joy and the messages of optimism, optimism and optimism. So listen to the very end because there is a message from Jesus and Krishna towards the end of the video. And there is a crystal also which wants to share its message in this video. So the first card, it's the tiger eye spirit. As we know that every creation begins with a thought and you have what it takes to do that creation, you know, to create uh, from, to create the physical part of the project or something that you have already previously thought. With a clear intention in mind, take a deep, deep breath, roll up your sleeves and begin the work. For its manifesting time, April is a manifesting time post Easter. And this tiger eye spirit is reminding us not to get distracted. And even if the task is large, you have the support of the conscious universe with you. And it's sending messages uh, to make the job easier. Prepare the soil for planting. And you may read a book, take a small course and educate yourself for the next phase. Get ready and some powerful manifestation energy is going to partner with you, is already partnering with you. The middle of the week, you spread that vivacious energy all around yourself and others take note of it. So ignited with the creative energies, you all move ahead. Please pause the video to read the message. Look at the image to find a symbol or meaning that is very personal to you from this image. And Towards the end of this video, I want to leave you with this message of love and kindness of Easter. Jesus said, love thy neighbor, and the message is repeated this week. We are also taught Atithi Devo Bhava. So it's not just a campaign that comes over the television. The thought of welcoming needs to be revisited this week. Ask your angels to show you in case you have some bitter thoughts that are persistent. They will show you some ways to embrace even who live close by to you. Because that is the most difficult thing. Because you have history and maybe difference of opinion. And it is all right. We are all unique and have unique ways of thinking. So embracing those who are near to us is advised both by Jesus and Krishna. Krishna welcomed Sudama after many years and let that embracing fervor motivate us. Please suggest topics that you like to know about and share feedback on this weekly videos. Have a great, great week. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much.